everyone welcome to civil engineering shilo's updates many people have confusions about how much square feet for one cent how much square feet for one ground how to measure a house how to use a measuring tape what is mean by square feet what is mean by one ground what is mean by one cent like this so many basic questions you may have let's see about this in this video First let us start with this measuring tape. How to use this measuring tape do you know? The length of this tape is 5 meter. 5 meter means 15 feet. In this tape itself they have given 5 meter. In this tape a key is given here. You can see here this is the key given here. If we pull out the tape and if we press this key we can lock it. And again if we press this key, the tape will go inside. This measuring tape is with yellow background. You can see here fully here yellow background. Uh, the top measurements of this tape are given in inches. What is mean by inches? In our forefinger up to this level is one inch. The same measurement is given here. You can see here this is one inch. Like this, 12 inches is equal to 1 feet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. After 11, the 12 inches is indicated as 1 feet here. 1 feet has been represented in red color. Bottom measurements are given in centimeter. 30 centimeter is equal to 1 feet. 30 centimeter has also been indicated here, which means this up to this 1 feet. If we again pull it out, we can see 2 feet, 3 feet, 4 feet, 5 feet, up to 15 feet. We can see inside. Uh, 10 centimeter, 20 centimeter, 30 centimeter, everything they have highlighted in red color. Which makes our work very easy. This tape has been available in many varieties in market. We can handle it very easily which is affordable one and we can keep it in our pockets also. Every site engineer has this measuring tape. If you want to do your land survey or brickwork in small area or to calculate the number of tiles in your small toilet, you can use this measuring tape. But for large area, for to calculate, to measure a whole house, you can use this digital laser measuring device. If you buy this, it has a lot of benefit than this measuring tape. What are all the benefits of this digital laser measuring device? The reference is always 100% straight. They are often very light and easy to use. This laser device can be extremely accurate. It can provide a measuring range that can extend up to 600 feet. Distance you have measured will turn into area or volume because the processor calculates it itself. Another only important thing is the readings are electronically displayed on the screen which you can easily read and record. Measuring a greater distance plus instant calculation becomes an easy thing while using this digital laser measuring tool. But the cost is quite expensive than this normal measuring tape. The cost of this digital laser measuring device is between rupees 1000 to rupees 5000. Now let's see what this mean by square feet. A yes, square feet has 1 feet length and 1 feet breadth. We have to multiply both this length and breadth. We know that the basic area formula is length into breadth which means if you have 1 feet length and 1 feet breadth means we have to multiply this 1 feet into 1 feet. So you will get 1 square feet. Similarly if we multiply 10 feet length into 10 feet breadth we will get 100 square feet. In this way you have to calculate area. Similarly a square meter has 1 meter length and 1 meter breadth. If we multiply this length and breadth, 1 meter into 1 meter, we will get 1 square meter. And another one important thing is, 1 ground is equal to 2400 square feet. 
half ground is equal to 1200 square feet. Mostly land measurements have been told in cents. 1 cent is equal to 435.6 square feet. And 1 ground in cents. 1 ground is equal to 5.51 cents. Now you have got the basic ideas which would be very useful for you. If you are constructing a house, just buy this machine tape and you can cross check your own construction work of your house. The rate of this measuring tape is rupees 150. Uh, it is one of the good measuring tapes. If you know these basic things, you can itself measure your own land or house. I hope this video is useful to you. If you like this video, kindly subscribe my channel Civil Engineering Shilu's Updates. Like this video, share this video to your friends and do support Civil Engineering Shilu's Updates. Thank you.